My name is Christian Oliveira. I'm a neuro ophthalmologist at the New York Presbyterian Weill Cornell Medicine, and today I'll be talking about optic disc drusen. Those are also known as optic nerve head drusen and pseudopapilledema. They are abnormal deposits of benign, usually calcific material within the optic disc, which is the front part of the optic nerve seen inside of the eye. They are of a known cause, and up to 1% of people may have them and oftentimes are unaware of it. Optic disc drusen may look like optic disc swelling, hence the name pseudopapilledema. Typically, patients with optic disc drusen do not notice any vision problems. However, brief episodes of graying out or flickering of vision lasting for a few seconds may occur. Over time, up to 70% of people may develop some degree of peripheral vision loss, which is typically asymptomatic. A neuro-ophthalmologist is experienced and trained in deciding whether an optic nerve looks swollen from an optic disc drusen or from other causes, and that way can avoid unnecessary worrying and testing. There is no proven treatment for optic disc drusen. However, follow-up with a neuro ophthalmologist is important. You can find patient information brochures on optic disc drusen and other neuro causes at the NUNUS website. Thank you for your attention.